Hey, this is Curious Chicks Travel, and today we're going to talk about Mike's Pastry versus Modern Pastry in Boston, Massachusetts. So Mike's Pastry has been home of the cannolis since 1946 and has over 20 different cannolis on the menu. Mamma mia! Oh my god! So I went to both the North End store as well as the Cambridge one, and I noticed that in the North End, the line kind of varied. It was either kind of short or it was really long, and unfortunately there was I had to wait in about a 20 minute line. But the one at Harvard is not really that bad. It's pretty small, there's not really a long line, but they don't have as much variety. So I tried so many different kinds. I loved the cho chocolate mousse cannoli because it was very light whipped kind of filling. Because the cannolis are huge, they're like this large and they, they have some of them have like little morsels, chocolate chip morsels on the end and then they, they offered a powder on, like powdered sugar on top of that. The espresso cannoli, I didn't like as much. It had a, I think it's because it's made out of ricotta filling. It, it felt like grainy inside and I didn't like it that one at all. I took like two bites and I was done. Mm -hmm. uh, but they're also known for their lobster tails which are ginormous as well and it's literally like a flaky pastry full of cream but it is something that a lot of people will get as well. So I tried the amaretto cannoli and that one had like an amaretto ricotta filling and then it was drizzled with chocolate on top and then on the end caps were slices of almonds. Mm -hmm. And I thought that was really good. I really enjoyed it. It's just super huge though. I also tried the Boston cream pie at the Cambridge one. It wasn't my favorite. I've had other Boston cream pies before and this one was just maybe a little bit drier and not as tasty as ones that I've had in the past. Mm. So basically across the street from Mike's Pastries is a place called Modern Pastry and it opened around the same time as Mike's. It felt more like an upscale kind of place in terms of the quality of their desserts. They use a lot of old world methods to make all of the candies and the cookies and the cakes that they offer there. They do offer cannolis there as well, but not as many as Mike's. I just had the traditional ricotta filling with the ends dipped in chocolate and then pistachio nuts on the side. I really enjoyed that one as well. It's definitely a lot smaller. The shell is thicker than I'd say the one at Mike's, so it's maybe a little bit harder to bite or take a bite into. They had a lot of different items. They were all decorated really nicely. You could tell that there was a lot more attention to detail in terms of how they prepare their pastries. So between the two, I have to say that I don't prefer one more than the other. I mean, if you really love cannolis, then Mike's might be better for you. But Modern Pastry has also very good cannolis as well. If you don't want like huge, huge portions mm -hmm. of desserts, then a little nice bite size is all you need, then Modern is, is, is great as well. So if you like this video, give us a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and follow us on Instagram at Curious Chicks Travel.